I met Jane now in the time of the accident, I was 13. Just had our breakfast as normal, went up to the farmyard. We were going to put out the livestock. Aaron was up in, up in the farmyard too. And we got the tractor. We had a ball hatch to put on her. Got the, the cattle filler on, you see, and then I reversed the tractor back. Aaron went away and he got the hatch. He was changing the hatch. Dad parked the tractor in front of the shed and he wanted to open the gate. And I thought the speed was up. I changed the hatch for him. I've done it before and never had no problems. Went under the shed and got the hatch out and went down the hatch to pull out the pans. Put on the new hatch. So instead of getting under the tractor to lock up the hatch then, I stood on the draw bar and reached in, pulled the lever for the left and the hatch came up. And my foot was about an inch too far in and I got caught and the hatch had latched. So I couldn't get myself released. So spontaneously I just lifted up the hatch again to release it, crushed my foot again. And I got the hatch released, got out, and I thought my toes was just bruised, that was it. So I walked across the yard to tell Dad, just collapsed in the middle of the yard. Everything after that then was a blur. I just seen the foot and that was enough. Knew what had happened. And run Catherine in. Aaron was lying in the yard in pain. And the first thing we decided to do was put him in the car and head for the hospital. I remember being in the hospital, two half my sock, and my toes just fell out. They completely cut off. I got men to the operating room, put back on my toes, with key wires, and I was in hospital for seven days after that. He was in and out of hospital, he was in with an infection, and then he had to go back in then to have the toes removed. And He's convalescing at home then, and between times. And he used to do a lot of training that time and running, and never left, finished that, all no. finished, never go back to it again. Too sore, his foot was always too sore. Whenever I go on holidays, I worry about who's going to see my foot, how they're going to react, young children or something. Whenever I'm near the swimming pool, are they going to make a big deal of it, are they going to notice? Is girl is going to notice? Is it going to cause problems? Whenever I be laying up in bed at night, relaxing, and I try not to think about it, but the pain's always there. I felt it was going to affect the confidence in other, the other people would have on me to do certain jobs. Never be looking for work or things like that. People would know that I had this accident and maybe I wasn't a safe person. Dad felt guilty about the accident. He felt as if it was his problem. He should have been there supervising me. He should have changed the hatch before he went to open the gate. But I don't blame him for the accident. It was my own fault. The, the children get confident, and you really have confidence in them doing it because they're well able to do it. And really, they don't really. You should be more careful. Don't let them do it on their own. Just stay with them, you know. They want them to have been secured and then go off and do open the gates or do whatever you want to do, like, you know. Take a whole new approach to farm safety, PTO guards, everything, take no risks at all now. I learned the lesson and I was thankful I got away lately. <laughs>